Shopping for birthday gifts is sure a tough job. I will write the labels for the birthdays while I rest. Hmm. I know that mom's birthday is on April 28th. But I just cannot remember what day her birthday falls on. It could be Monday or maybe it is Wednesday. Oh dear, I wish someone could help me. Hi Amber. You just made a wish, so I'm here to help you. Tell me, how can I help you? Thanks, Fairy. I have bought this present for my mother's birthday. I want to write the date and day of her birthday on it. Now, I have written the date, but I don't remember what day her birthday falls on. Can you tell me, Fairy? I can. But I have a better idea. I will teach you to use a calendar. What's a calendar? A calendar is a table that shows all the days and months in a year. It will tell you exactly which day 28 April is. This is what a calendar looks like. There are 12 months in a year. They are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November and December. It also has a list of all the days in a month. You must have noticed that each month has a different number of days. January, March, May, July, August, October and December have 31 days. April, June, September and November have 30 days. Hey, I think you have left out February. <laughs> no, Amber. February is a special month. It has 28 or 29 days. Usually, February has 28 days. But once in four years, February has 29 days. The year in which February has 29 days is called a leap year. All this is great. But how will I know which day April 28 is? I was coming to that. We start by looking at the month April. A week has seven days. Each letter here stands for the name of each day. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. They form a column. When we want to find the day of a date, we look for the date and see under which day's column it falls. Now, let us look for 28th April. The column will tell you which day 28th April falls on. So you see, April 28 falls on a Saturday. Hey, thanks Fairy. I will write Saturday on the present. A calendar also tells us the different festivals in a year. For example, our Republic Day falls on the 26th of January. Christmas comes on 25th December. 
You can also mark important days in a calendar, such as your birthday. My birthday falls on May 10th, so I have marked the date in this calendar. It's recap time, friends. Here we go. A calendar is a table that shows all the days and months in a year. The 12 months in a year are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November and December. January, March, May, July, August, October and December have 31 days. April, June, September and November have 30 days. February has 28 or 29 days. Once in 4 years, February has 29 days. The year in which February has 29 days is called a leap year. A week has 7 days. They are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. A calendar gives information about festivals and important days in a year.